These goldfish have an attention span of eight seconds, which is longer than the attention span of most people. Because people have such short attention spans, it is important to grab their attention immediately. Once you have it, your introduction, whether for a paper or presentation, should tell your co-communicators three things. One, the issue you plan to address. Two, your purpose for communicating, also known as your thesis or claim. And three, the key points you plan to discuss throughout your paper or presentation. Let's look at a sample entrepreneurship paper from BGen 104. Born a slave in Tennessee, Sarah Gammon Bickford grew up to become one of Montana's first female entrepreneurs. Her pluck and determination led to her success as a business person in Virginia City. Reflecting on others' successes and comparing their skills to my own will help me determine what I need to improve in order to become successful. To gain a better understanding of what makes entrepreneurs such as Bickford successful, I will examine her personal history and business ideas, as well as her strengths and weaknesses as a business person, and then compare Bickford's traits to my own strengths and weaknesses weaknesses in an analysis of my potential. The first sentence grabs people's attention. Readers will want to know more about how Bickford overcame such odds. The first and second sentence work together to introduce the issue. They make it clear that this paper will tell the story of Sarah Bickford. The third sentence is the thesis statement. This describes the purpose of the paper. The last sentence is the preview statement, which introduces people to the key points featured in the paper. It is clear that the paper will cover Bickford's personal and business history as well as an analysis of both her strengths and weaknesses as well as the author's. Your co-communicators should have a good understanding of your entire message just by reading or listening to your introduction. When writing a paper or presentation, you must get your audience's attention first. Then, introduce the issue you plan to discuss, state your thesis or purpose, and preview your key points. If you have any issues writing a good introduction, come see us at the BBCC.